They say, is there anything whereof may be said? See, this is new. It has, it has already, it has been already the whole time, which was before us. There is no remembrance of former things, neither shall there be any, re any remembrance of the things that are to come with those that shall come out of yeah, like his brother was saying, because uh, football is nothing but like the modern, modern day gladiatorial sport. Just like that's like uh, that's how we know America is Roman and reincarnation. When you look at the Super Bowl, the numbers of the Super Bowl is always written in Roman numerals. And the stadiums are shaped just like the ancient Roman coliseums and all that. And like you know, in the ancient world, the the, the gladiators, a lot of them were slaves, and they would win their freedom. You know, from fighting in the arena. And pretty much it's the same way Jake do it today. He gets his freedom by getting all that money. Well, so called free. He's still yeah, free. Like US, they got the same little, oh, yeah, little, yeah, little, yeah, little cage set up there. Yeah. And that's, that's a real violent sport. If they had their way, they're going to bring back full on blood sports back. They're going to fight to the death. If they had their way. That's where it's moving to. Was that the movie that came out? Mocking Jake. Uh, one movie uh, with, with the girl shooting that bow and arrow. The Hunger Games. Hunger Games. Yeah, yeah. they gonna bring that shit back, man. Yeah. Hunger Games. Yeah. People yeah. become like a, a, a actual blood sports. I heard they got they got shit like that where you go hunting. I've heard the stories. The actual place you can for the wealthy is the places where you can go pay a lot of money to go hunt people. Yeah, yeah, just like that movie. What's the name of that on uh, with uh, Ice T? Oh yeah, I forget uh, what you're talking about. about. I know that movie. Though. They do that shit. They do that shit with the ham I saw in Africa. Actually, they always show the pictures of Esau hunting a big game in Africa. They be they be hunting the kids and shit right like now. Yeah. I mean, they got places where the uh, you seen that movie Hostel, right? Time. Yeah. Where uh, these rich Edomites they they go pay a uh, couple hundred thousand or whatever to go uh, rape children. They be melting their faces off, torturing them. You know what I mean? That's real. Y'all know who the Scorpions is, is right? A rock and roll group. Y'all heard of the Scorpions from the '80s? They're from Germany. But the bass player from the Scorpions, he said he went to one of these snuff parties. He said, it, I think he paid like 40000 to get in the party. And he said they was in there raping children, killing people, you know what I mean, doing some bugged out shit. You can look that up on YouTube. I'm going to check it out, though. Like, that shit crazy. Yeah. But some of that shit, like, I got to refrain myself. Like, when I checked out the piece of gay shit, yeah. I was digging too deep. I was like, man, you get the fuck out of here, man. Like, yeah, that piece of gay shit. Hell yeah, man. I mean, you look at all these uh, politicians. You got this dude just uh, got locked up, David Hester, the uh, former Speaker of the House, going back a few years, right? The Speaker of the House is third in command in the government, right? You got the President, Vice President, and the Speaker of the House. Third in command in the uh, United States, right? He's got caught molesting little boys. You know what I mean? It's always come out, these politicians always getting caught molesting little boys, uh, having sex, what they call them, their pages, their assistants. They always get caught up in, like you said, pizza game. Yeah, man. So this whole country is ran by pedophiles, devil worshippers. Now America was founded by Freemasons. America was founded by Freemasons, and they called them the Sons of Liberty. And they met together at uh, Freemasonic lodges and conspired against the King of England. And that's how they overthrew the king. Was with the, in the Freemasonic lodges. That's in the history book. And the Freemasons are devil worshippers. That's why they be taking them secret oaths. Oh, that's why y'all have seen that President Kennedy speech, right? When he talked about the secret societies and the secret oaths and secret proceedings. They blew his top right off of his put a whole right in his head. They killed him. They made a public example of him, yo. Right on. Neighbors 3 and 1. Woe to the bloody city. It is all full, full of lies and robbery. The play, the, it's like the prey departeth not. Right, the noise of, of, of a whip and the noise of rattling of the wheels. Right, you know, when you hear that, you go like that. Or you hear sirens and shit like that. So people walking back and forth. I just find it right, well, You know, this country was uh, built, built upon like bloodshed. You know, the, uh, right, the slavery of the southern kingdom. You know, as far as like the uh, rape and robbery and murder of the northern kingdom. You know, which is talking about you know, like the Native Americans and all that. Alright, but uh, it's basically exposing like the uh, wickedness. Uh, uh, sorry, it said, it just reminded me on my way up here, it said, uh, what did it say about the plane? Because like, we was on, up on the way up here driving here from Columbus, took like a two hour drive or whatever. You know, 
Every couple of miles, there's a highway patrolman sitting there just, just, just setting a trap for your ass, ready to get you. You know what I mean? And they was all over. I seen all kind of people pulled over. That's why these cops out here constantly fucking with you to keep you in slavery, keep you broke. They gonna pull you over, give you a hundred twenty dollar ticket. You know what I mean? Yeah, well, well yeah, that, that's just court costs. Yeah. Well, I know in Columbus, they let you off on court costs on everything. They just want to get a little couple uh, dollars out. <laughs> yeah. like, if, you're a, if you're a repeat offender, you don't get that. Well, and then there, there's all, they, like up here, they even have like, uh, you know, there's there's even like a small, I wouldn't call them like police, like they're like not armed or anything, uh, but they're uh, designated to all. You know, white people like uh, you know, tickets as far as like parking violations and shit like yeah, that. That's some faggot shit. Yeah, that's some straight up fucking faggot shit. Just make, just, just stay here with a, the purpose to make your life a living hell, man. And you see, uh, every time there's a police shoot, a cop shoot somebody on the uh, on the streets, you look on YouTube, the video, the comment section, people always taking up for the cops. Oh, you should have listened to what they said. You wasn't doing nothing wrong, you got nothing to worry about. Say that when your ass get pulled over and they writing your ass a ticket. You know what I'm saying? This is uh, Job 9 and 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof, not wearing who is he. Oh, yeah, they cover the faces of the judges. Right here. Oh, here, that's the picture right here. Well, yeah, they, they put this devil up right here. They say he was the Lord. Don't match nowhere near the description in the Bible. Cause the Lord's a dark-skinned man with woolly hair. He ain't got none of that. We got another one back here. So that's, that's more of a true image of the Lord right here. There's a dark-skinned man with woolly hair. Okay? And that's how they do it. They cover the faces of the judges. You know, they painted over all the images and just made some new images, you know, during the Renaissance era. Because you look at all the images of the saints and the prophets before the Renaissance period, they was all dark-skinned. <laughs> hey, and that's what they say with the earth is given to the hand of the wicked. Hey, because number one, the nation of Israel, you Negroes, Latinos, Hispanics, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all, y'all destroyed for lack of knowledge, man. Y'all don't know how wicked this place is, man. This place was built off of, off of slavery, man. It was it was built off of a murder, man. You know what I'm saying? Built built off of rich people and their they heritage, man. Especially Esau, so they take everybody down heritage, man. You know what I'm saying? They, they paint the likeness of their images. You know what I'm saying? And that, and that's what we are here to do, man. To wake wake the elect up, man. The, the new Jerusalem, man. The first fruits of the kingdom, man. Our people despise it, though. And they want to continue to eat GMOs, breathe in chemtrails. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, continue to eat from these fast food, fast food places, which is human DNA in the food. You know? Hey, but they just, they gone, man. They they just destroyed, man. You know? Yeah, they don't care about no truth or knowledge. You know, we got we live in a day. We live in an age of information, right? We everybody got a smartphone in their pocket. You got access to old knowledge of human history, right in your pocket. And what do they use that that device for? To watch porn, to watch world star hip hop, to watch some bullshit. You know what I mean? Watch some let's play videos on YouTube. I be up on YouTube and on Wikipedia, and I be up on the internet till six in the morning reading history. You know what I mean? Look at mathematics, geometry, anything I can get a hold of, I'm getting it. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a good point. Twelve, like four and I get it. Yeah, because basically, like you're saying, man, you got here it is, man. You got access to like literally. Inf information, endless information, and in, in in your at the touch of your damn palms, and people all they do, you on goddamn Instagram and, and Twitter all goddamn dead, worried about other people's business, man. All you see is that goddamn thumb. All you see is that thumb scrolling up and damn down, man. Not researching nothing of uh of importance, man. These people are goddamn baffling idiots, man. With jerseys on, man. Uh, and it's, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be our pleasure to see this goddamn place get burned down to uh, sh uh fucking uh. Nothing, man. That's right. The Most High is gonna have his way when he have uh, and he gonna have the Lord, the, uh, his men get busy on you damn people, man. He gonna put, he gonna have the, uh, the spirit of, 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 of the ancient men on here putting people to death, man. Righteous, uh, righteous death, man. We gonna, we gonna run through them like, uh, 
Like hot night, a hot night. Like a, like a, yeah. <laughs> like a hot night with your butter, that's a problem. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that's gonna be smoother than butter. Hey, but look, yeah. But that's when the Lord gives us power, though. The Lord gonna give us power. You know what I mean? Right now, we ain't got no power. This is, I mean, this is a lot of power. But the Lord going to give us power over the nations. Hey, somebody get that. I'm going to read this. And somebody give me that Revelation uh, 2 and 26. Yeah, you know. Uh, Daniel 12 and 4. But thou, O Daniel, shut up the words and seal the book, even to the time of the end. Many shall run to and fro, and knowledge shall be increased. So that was a prophecy scripture. And it said it sealed a book up in the Bible to the end. And we, everybody know we in the end days. If this ain't the end, this is the most evil period in history we ever lived in. Hey, Because if we, if we go any further into the future, the only thing you got to look forward to is uh, fake food, fake titties and ass. Uh, 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 the, the drugs gonna get a lot worse. Cause they show you that on that movie, uh, when you watch Ghost in the Shell, she was using some goddamn like futuristic drugs, man. Like the people was bugged the hell out, man. It's gonna get, it's gonna be like Futurama. Like if you was in the future, like ten years from now, you have brothers on the run. You know what I mean? You're like, why would we be holographic? You know what I mean? You, you know what I'm saying? Like you go, it's like something like that damn comic book movie, man. Our garments would be like, just like man, or equilibrium, man. You know, it happened to be like underground and shit. Hell yeah, man. You see, like a brother, like you know what I mean? Like, we be out here on hoverboard. Yeah, man. That's it, man. Like, man, what? Like they already got them though. I mean. If you were like, we already there. Man. Yeah, we is. Except for the hoverboard, and they got the they got Nike boards. They got the self lacing shoes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You see that? Like yeah. just on Back to the Future. I was my son was watching a video yesterday. Dude put his shoes on. They was like, Yeah, they got the Now we in the future. Like you said, everybody got an Android phone or an iPhone in their pocket, where you got the access to all the the history of mankind right in your pocket, and people ain't even using it. But we using the hell out of it. We abusing it. We because it ain't gonna be here forever. They already trying to shut the internet down. Uh, we just got a uh, one of our. You know when your brothers came down uh, to Columbus, right? They deleted one of our videos. Did they? They said it was hate speech. Damn. And we was just sitting, just kicking and laughing, talking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They used to delete the shit out of your channel. My, back is back in the day. That was back in Obama. Obama's first. He was getting. They was doing everybody. Like back in like 2010 was a rough year. You couldn't keep a channel on YouTube. You know what I mean? I got some. And it's Amos 8 and 11. It said, Behold, the days come, saith the Lord the Most High, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread nor a thirst for water, but the hearing of the word of the Lord Yahweh. Right, because they're not going to let us keep uploading all these videos on. It's a problem. Us putting all these videos up on YouTube. And that's another reason, too. You come out here to make sure people are here, you know what I mean? But that's a problem yeah. for them. Soon they're they, they going to put an end to it. it and it's going to be a time when we're not out here teaching. And that's going to be a time, it's going to be too late for you. You know what I mean? Hey, it's like y'all too, I just want to bring up like, they show you this actual hoverboard, man. Yeah, look. See it. I ain't getting no Oh yeah, I see it. Yeah, actual hoverboard. Like, it's actually floating. They got other ones too where that is like off the ground way more though. Hey, Back to the Future is only out for a couple years. Yeah. Hey, they almost got the Cubs World Series right. <laughs> That's predicted pro. Hey, there's a video on YouTube that goes into Back to the Future and how Back to the Future uh, predicted 9 11. Oh, yeah. Um, you seen that? I ain't seen that clip, but I did see certain videos like that. Because that, these devil uses witchcraft. Yep. Hey, you know what the word? Yeah, Hollywood is all about witchcraft. That's why it's called Hollywood. Now, what is Hollywood? Hollywood, because the Holly. The holly tree or uh, whatever, that's where they make magic wands from, is the holly. If you, like, the devil worshippers, they get the holly, the magic wand made out of Hollywood. So, because the, the, the true magician... The devil put, is alive, fellas. 
And it, that's, his name's uh, Esau. Right. <laughs> uh, what was I about to say? Oh, yeah, they cast a spell. Out. How do you cast a spell out somebody? What does the word spell mean? That means to use words, you spell out words. So they cast the spells on you with these words in the music. They put a spell on you with that music. That's, that's witchcraft. All this rap music, country, all this music, all this popular, it's all witchcraft. They cast the spells on you with these movies. They make these movies, they put homosexual characters in the movies, so all this symbolism, and they're trying to alter your perception of reality. You know what I mean? And that's why they, they use these movies and TV shows that push your agenda. The feminization of the man. That's why you watch all these TV shows. That all the men are weaklings. Oh, the, wo the woman's running a house. And yeah, I'm yeah. We talk about that when we was down there. Yo, man. Oh, yeah. you, had, you got Wonder Woman. Like, and then we talk about the Megatron. Like how he, the, oh, yeah. Out of all things, Optimus Prime went up there and then it was a goddamn fucking female robot that created him, man. Uh, oh, that's <laughs> oh, yeah. That was some bullshit, man. Because that's a, that's like I said, that's a demasculation of, of, of men, man. Shit, yeah, Megatron was a good guy. Yeah, yeah, man. Hell yeah. Just like Bane. Bane and, uh, and Batman. Batman. Oh, Batman's an uncle. Oh, yeah, yeah. Batman, Batman. Uncle Tom. <laughs> so, yeah, all that. Hey, verse 12, and they shall wonder from sea to sea. And from the north even to the east, and they shall run to and fro and seek the word of the Lord and shall not find it. Yeah, because all of a sudden when things go bad and everything's terribly wrong, all of a sudden the people want to go get the Bible. Oh, this got to be, I got to search the scripture. And the miss, you know, when the missiles are hitting, everyone's dying, all of a sudden y'all want to go read the Bible. Yeah. That's too late. It's too late. Hey, hey uh, if I can add too, just like when them, them hurricanes hit down there, like yes. then, then you have Ephraim, they were showing a video of Ephraim was Leo's praying. Leo's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's some sisters. Yeah. Man, get the hell out of here, man. The Lord going to put more of y'all people to death because that show you the hypocrisy, man. That's right. Because once the once people start getting put to death, the, the, the instant the, inst the instinct inside of mankind is to ultimately get on them knees and pray, man. Yeah. That ain't going to happen in that day, man. The even Lord, the, even right. the atheists are doing it. Oh, hell yeah, man. You hear them say, oh, my God, I thought you didn't believe in God, right, man. Yeah. Now you're calling on God, man. When the Lord bring that, that pale horse, and that uh that, that that he bring that pale horse in Revelation when that but it ain't an actual horse, it's just a symbolized yeah. and when that when that pale horse come through uh uh these uh this place called America, it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna cause a a a, a, a wake up call, man. You people gonna ain't gonna be no more at Star Starbucks, Instagram, you know the the, the, the regular festivities yeah, that people yeah, yeah. used to, man. Ain't no more Browns games, no Cavs games. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? LeBron gonna be down here on his knees with y'all, man. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? Donald Trump can't save y'all from the Lord, man. America can't can't save y'all from the Lord, the Holy One of Israel. That's right. So he coming to say that he grows Latinos, Hispanics, and Native and Seminole Indians, man. That's right. The so-called white white man that go back to Esau, the Edomites. There's no salvation for you, man. The two thirds nation of Israel is gonna be put to fucking death, man. Yep. If they despise the word of the heavenly father, man. Come on, man. Matter of fact, I you read that revelation. But that uh he had the pill of the horse in the sixth six chapter. You got it back there, man. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, no, you know, you got the spirit. It's all you. It's all you. You gotta wait for the spirit. Yeah, yeah. He, he got it. She got the spirit. Uh, start from uh, verse. Start from verse two. Uh, it's Revelation chapter six, verse two. It says, "And I saw and behold a white horse, and he that sat on him had a bow, and a crown was given unto him, and he went forth conquering, and to conquer." You want, you want it back on? No, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah, that. That white horse is talking about, uh, 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 it's, uh bring it back real quick. This, time. this Revelation chapter 6, verse 2, it's saying, I saw and behold a white horse, and he that sat on him had a bow. Yeah, 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 yeah that, that white horse is, is basically the chariot, all right, the Lord coming back on, and then it's saying, him that sat upon, that's, that's Yahweh Shah himself, man. All right, go ahead. And, and as the crown was given unto him, and he went forth conquering and to conquer. And yeah, what? And when he had opened the second seal, I heard the second beast say, come and see. Yep, and there went out another horse that was red. Yep. And power was given unto him that sat there, there, there on to take place, to take peace from the earth. Yeah, man, that, that red horse, they thank you. That red horse is talking about Esau, man. Esau is that that, that red horse that, that's been placed upon the earth to bring nothing but death, destruction, and uh, violence upon this place, man. Now, that's why you got everything uh, dying, man. You got total, it was, it was a goddamn, uh, 
uh, uh, uh, whole way got sucked up uh, when I heard oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But we know that was from the, uh, that, 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 that geoengineer storm that Esau created. Because you got a movie, and me and my brother, we did a video on it. It's called uh, Geo Storm. That's a movie coming out. Lord willing, I'm going to watch it. They showed you in that movie. The dude plainly said it on the preview. You can watch